हेलो चिल्ड्रन तो हम आ गए हैं कोऑर्डिनेट ज्योमेट्री के लास्ट पार्ट पर दैट इज द ऑप्शनल एक्सरसाइज मगर इससे घबराने की जरूरत नहीं है इतनी ज्यादा टफ नहीं है फर्स्ट स्टार्ट करते हैं क्वेश्चन नंबर वन से लाइन सेगमेंट ज्वाइनिंग टू माइनस टू एंड बी थ्री सेवन एंड अनदर लाइन टू एक्स प्लस वाई माइनस फोर इक्वल टू जीरो कट एट द पॉइंट से पी वी वॉन्ट टू कैलकुलेट दैट वॉट इज द रेशियो बिटवीन ए पी एंड पी बी इट मीन्स रेशियो इज अनोन एंड वेन एवर रेशियो इज अनोन वॉट वी एज्यूम के इज टू वन सो फर्स्ट वी कैलकुलेट दिस पॉइंट एक्स कॉमा वाई विद द रेशियो के इज टू वन सो एक्स इक्वल टू नथिंग के इंटू थ्री थ्री के वन इंटू टू टू डिवाइड बाय के प्लस वन is the value of x similarly the value of y k into 7 plus 1 into minus 2 divide by k plus 1 these are the coordinates of p correct now when you know p p is also a junction of these two lines do road ke chaurai par hai p iska matlab p will satisfy this line also same as in your class 9 so now 2 times x x means what we have calculated 3k plus 2 upon k plus 1 plus y y means 7k minus 2 divided by k plus 1 correct 2 x plus y minus 4 equal to 0 now what is lcm k plus 1 so multiply the whole equation by k plus 1 what we are getting 6k plus 4 Plus seven k minus two minus four k minus four k and minus four equal to zero. Six k and seven k thirteen k thirteen k minus four k nine k. Four and minus four cancel out. Remaining is only two. That is k equals to two by nine. And when k equals to two by nine, what's the ratio? Two by nine is to one. And in a ratio, we can multiply both the side by nine, so it will become two is to nine. So our final answer is the line will cut this line segment in the ratio two is to nine. Easy. Question number third. These three are the points on any circle. Say A. B and C anywhere. A point is six minus six. B is three seven. Say three minus seven, three three, and six minus six. We can plot anywhere. Three minus seven, three three, and six minus six are the points on the circumference of the circle. We want to calculate its center. Again, what's the definition? If this one is center and these are the points A, B, C, then you know the basic condition of the circle is all these three are radii, and length of radius is the same for a same circle. एक circle की radius सब तरफ same होती है. It means what is given to you indirectly O A equals to O B equal to O C. Or what we say O A square equals to O B square equal to O C square. O A O B O C equal. Hence, their squares are equal. Why we are squaring? Because we know that the distance formula is in square root. We want to remove that square root. Correct. So now O A square. Suppose O point is x comma y. We have to apply the distance formula. X minus three, the whole square, plus y plus seven, the whole square. This is O A square. Equals to O B square. X minus three the whole square, y minus three the whole square. O C square equals to x minus six the whole square, and y plus six the whole square. Right? Now if we compare first and second or first and third, second and third or second and first, your choice. But you have to solve two pairs. So first we start from first and third. X square, six x, nine y square, fourteen y, forty nine. Is the first. Third, 
x square minus 12x plus 36 plus y square plus 12y plus 36. Solve these two. x square and y square, see both the same. Same, cancel out. Minus 6x and minus 12x. This come to this side. It will become 6x. Simple transposition. 14y and 12y come to this side. 2y. And all numbers on right hand side. So numbers are 36 and 36, 72. And 49 and 9, 58. What we are getting? 12 minus 8, 4. And 6 minus 5, 1. This is 6x plus 2y. And 2 is common. We can cancel out with 2. So it is the last final part is first equation 3x plus y equals to 7. Easy. Now for the second part, say we can take first and second. First is already with us x square, 6x, 9, y square, 14y and 49 is the first one. Compare with second one, x square, 6x, 9, y square, 6y and 9. x square and y square, same, cancel out. Minus 6x and minus 6x cancel out. Remaining is 14y and 6y, 21 equals to numbers 9 and 9 18 and here minus 58 it is minus 40 so y equals to minus 2 now when y minus 2 we can substitute here so put y minus 2 here 3x minus 2 equal to 7 3x equals to 9 so x equals to 3 x is 3 and y is minus 2 x is 3 and y is minus 2. So what is the center of this circle? 3 and minus 2. It means if you calculate 3 minus 2 to all these 3, obviously equals to radius. And suppose one more part of the same question, find the radius also. Then no problem. Put x and y value in any one of them. You will get a square of radius. And then take the under root, you will get the length of the radius. Up at the Question number four. हाँ एक मेरा suggestion था lockdown time में आप लोग एक अपना fix time बनाइए घर पर पढ़ने का ऐसे नहीं कभी भी उठे कभी भी पढ़िए तो एक school की feeling आएगी कि हम सुबह आठ बजे पढ़ने बैठ गए है ना तो time to time हाँ revise करना है तो वापस revise कर लो शाम को मगर एक शेड्यूल बनाओ कि हमको सुबह आठ बजे उठ करके पढ़ने बैठना है करें अच्छा लगेगा आपको कल के क and four coordinates are given to you. A, B, C, D. But two are missing. A corner is minus one, two. B is missing, suppose X, Y. And C is given to you corner three, two. And fourth is also missing, by the way, Z, W. We want to calculate the opposite coordinate B and D and A and C already given. You know, if we join A to C, it is nothing but Pythagoras triangle. It means this angle is 90 degree, this will be the hypotenuse. And since it is a square, all the four sides are equal. So here we apply the properties of square. First, we know that AB equals to BC. Again the same thing. Since it is a distance formula, and in distance formula it is a square root, we want to remove square root. That's why squaring both the sides. So AB equal to BC, but a b square equal to b c square. What is a b square? x plus 1 the whole square, y minus 2 the whole square, now b c x minus 3 the whole square and y minus 2 the whole square. Whole square formula ana chahi? Ah. x square plus 2 x plus 1, y square minus 4 y plus 4, x square minus 6 x plus 9 and y square minus 4 y plus 4. Now, y square and x square, y square and x square, same as the previous sum, cancel out. 2x and 6x, 8x. Minus 4y and minus 4y, cancel out. Now, numbers 5, 9 and 4, 13. 
13 minus 5, that is 8. So x equals to, we are getting only 1. Clear? When x is 1, we want to calculate the second coordinate y, third coordinate z, fourth coordinate w. How we calculate? We have the relation of Pythagoras theorem. What is Pythagoras theorem? The longest side is square. Which one is longest side? AC square equals to AB square plus BC square. So what is AC square? The distance formula 3 plus 1 the whole square and 2 minus 2 the whole square. Check it again. 3 minus 1 the whole square, 2 minus 2 the whole square. It is hypotenuse. AB square, x plus 1 the whole square, y minus 2 the whole square, bc square, x minus 3 whole square and y minus 2 the whole square. What we have completed just now. This 4 square 16 and 0 equals to x square plus 2x plus 1 plus y square 4y same thing. We have to write it again. Now what we have calculated already, x equals to 1. So in this complete equation, put x equals to 1. See what we are getting, x equals to 1, x equals to 1, y square, 4y, 4, x equals to 1, x equals to 1, 9, y square, 4y and 4. We are getting y square and y square, that is 2y square y minus 4y and minus 4y that is minus 8y correct now all the numbers 4 and 9 13 13 14 14 minus 6 8 8 and 4 12 12 12 and 1 13 13 and 3 16 16 and 16 0 2y is common y minus 4 it means either y equals to 0 or y equals to 4. Why? Two products. Two product equals to 0. It means either this one is 0 or this one is 0. Two things product 0. I can't say that 5 into 3 is 0. No. Suppose it is 5y and 3y plus 2 equal to 0. What does It means either this one is 0 or this one is 0. Correct. So here y is 0 or y is 1. We have x equals to 1 already and y we have two options 1 0 and 1 4. 1 x is y 1 for both these two same but y equals to 1 times 0 and other time it is 4. So these are the two opposite corners. Homework is called graph number. Now question number 6. Question number 6 based on similarity Triangle ABC is given with A coordinate 4, 6, coordinate B 1, 5, coordinate C 7, 2. Question is, the D and E are the points here such that AD divided by AB is 1 is to 4. We want to calculate the area of triangle ADE. A concept of similarity is, whenever a line is parallel to the another line, these two triangles are similar. Why we have already completed in one question that if two angles, if two angles are equal by double A criteria, triangles are similar. It means triangle ADE is similar to triangle ABC. It is clear. Then next theorem is areas of these two triangles, areas of these two similar triangles are in the ratio of square of their corresponding sides. A square of their corresponding sides. So here the ratio is given AD 1 and AB 4. So here we can write 1 is to 16. Ye confirm hai ki in ke areas ka ratio 1 is to 16 hoga. Now we know how to calculate triangle ABC. Area of triangle ABC very simple. By using our shoelace method. How we calculate? 4, 6, 1, 5, 7, 2 and repeat the first one again. Now you can solve it. Half. First, 
20 plus 2 plus 42 minus shortcut 6 35 and last 8 if you add all these what we are getting 64 and if you add all these what we are getting 49 so answer is 15 by 2 15 by 2 is the answer or the area of the triangle ABC so here we can write 15 by 2 and this area we have to calculate ADE now cross multiply what you are getting ADE area equals to 15 by 2 into 1 by 16 that is 15 by 32 is the area of triangle ADE. Question is very simple but concept you have to learn the concept from the similarity. When we do similarity, we will be able to physical. Now the last concept of this topic coordinate geometry is how we calculate the coordinate of a centroid. You know from your class 9, centroid means a point which will divide the median in the ratio 2 is to 1. This coordinate is said to be G. And you know, suppose this one is x1, y1, x2, y2, x3, y3 are the coordinates. What about the coordinate of D? Median means D is a midpoint. And midpoint formula you know very well, average. x2 plus x3 divided by 2, y2 plus y3 divided by 2. Now how we calculate coordinate G? Apply the section formula. x1 into 1 plus 2 into x2 plus x3 whole divided by 1 plus 2. Comma. Same for y. 2 into y2 plus y3 divided by 2 plus 1 into y1 divided by 1 plus 2, 3. What we are getting? Centroid is average x1 plus x2 plus x3 divided by 3 and y1 plus y2 plus y3 divided by 3. Just a midpoint ke liye kya hota tha? Average of 2 points. Aise centroid ke liye kya hoga? Average of 3 points. Ye question karte hai. Suppose a triangle with coordinates 1, 2, 3, 7, 8, 11. We want to calculate the coordinate of centroid direct using this formula. So G coordinate is first 1 plus 3 plus 8 divided by 3, 2 plus 7 plus 11 divided by 3. Answer is 8 and 3. 11 and 12, 12 by 3, 4. 2 and 7, 9. 11 and 9, 20. Answer is 20 by 3. It is said to be centroid, where all the three medians intersect. It is said to be centroid. But we can calculate very easily by simple average. So, here we complete the coordinate geometry. We are going to go ahead and go Jitni reference books aapko mile, unse practice jada kare. Because Max wants practice and practice and practice. Aage padhte rahiye, badhte rahiye, aur ek condense develop karte rahiye. Milte hain agla topic lekar ke probability. Mujhe aapke likes milne se jada, tab khushi hogi jab aapke bhot achhe number aayenge. Correct? Take care. Goodbye.